Hi, my name is Manta from Tricycle. Today I'll be teaching you how to add the C22P IMO camera and then how to use, use it the feature function from the phone. So before that, you want to add the C22P, C22P camera, you have to install the app called IMO Live App. So once you download the IMO Live App, you, you go in. And over here, to, to add the device, you click on the plus sign. And then scan the QR code. Then you scan the QR code right behind the camera. So once you add the camera ready, just click on next. And so after that, change your camera whether uh, it's power on. After that, oh you have to select your Wi-Fi. Wi-Fi. Then also it's support only 2.4G, cannot support 5G. After so that, just click on next. And show, show your camera show the green light flashing and click on next then to over here to turn on your uh, audio to able to have the camera to connect to your phone Alright, so over here for the device password will be pass 12345. Pass 12345, after that, I'll click on next and then wait for it to connect to the camera. So once it's done, done adding already, so over here you can name your device and if not you can just leave it and click on next. So after here you can also uh, uh, can choose where you want to put so by the way at home okay, you can just go on down. After that for this one it's just a uh, IMO project which you want to activate or subscribe it. If not you can do it later. So after that you want to have your camera, view the live. So we can check. Right, so it is our line. So if you want to do, uh, so you can able to see here. There's a few button. So in order, you want to stop or so pause or continue the video to press over here. Then over here we can actually minimize the full camera if you have additional camera with the same one then after that you want to enlarge you want to enlarge and the video sorry video resolution the high definition standard so we recommend the high definition to see more clearly then to on, to on the audio sound you can click on the icon and also you can able to enlarge the, the tab yeah mm. So after that, you want to view your playback, then so you can go to under event history timeline. So over here, it will be a cloud and then there's an SD card. So, so if, once you have inserted your SD card, then you will start, uh, start auto recording by your motion, motion moving on. Then for another cloud, if you want to you need to subscribe, yes, I can show you the price of the cloud. So over here, you want to subscribe. So there's are two different so one will be basic and the one will be plus so under basic the the benefit will have seven days cloud storage so you need to download sd card recording and share device with only max 10 users and the security report so then for plus plus the different use will be there's a seven, 30 days cloud storage and there's a ai detection and also same as a basic the download sd card recording then this one will be able to share device with 20 users and that's a security report so so for the amount I can show you for so for basic I want to subscribe so the price the ranging I can show you the, uh, per month and per year so this one will be per one camera per year 
So one camera pair will be almost thirty dollar. Then for up to five cameras will be almost a hundred dollar for basic. Then if a plus one it will be actually triple double or triple the price. So you guys check the price between the basic and the plus. So if you think it's X, you know they can recommend you to buy the SD card instead. But for this camera it's only can able to record up to only seven days. If not after that it will auto overwrite. They will start the new new recording uh, per week. Okay, so yeah so over here you can check. Okay, so over here if you want to actually to talk to someone then you can actually under here you can speak to the camera. Wait like, hello hello okay, we have speak okay, not can power the microphone and then if you want to share the device with uh, your family members or your friends you can go to click on the icon that uh, queue, uh, towards the one o'clock last sign okay, able to share the device over here with the second user or third user as well over here they can see for non uh, SD card or this app itself with no never subscribe the cloud will be able, only can up to 6 users and then after that you want to so for second user you want to let uh, can sell or you want to let the second user do so you want to let the second user can be able to see the live view or the device function basic device function can even enable it by taking the box they able to set the alarm or the manager management as well. If not, after that you can actually just press above, press that event, and the management will be stable. Management after that just jump done. Then there's a QR code pop up to, for the second user to scan. They they able to view the cam camera view as well. Ready? Right, so over here, then you want to view at the settings, right? Right. You look right top corner. So over here you can set. You can check the on of the recording and the SD card or car as well so for SD card we insert so you so can select the time uh, even the video actually you can see the time so see the time where you want to uh, view the playback then you can click on it and then you can able to view the live view and you can adjust the timing as well then show the device features so if you want to Enable the motion detection under notification, then you on the notification. Right, so any movement or detect, they will alert you. So the detection will go here, so you sense the motion detection on, then you can off it. Then motion sensitive, then the generation activity, activity zone, you can set uh, which area that you want to detect. Now, after that, then below here for AI detection or cloud storage, you want to uh, enable it. Then you need have to subscribe actually to the IMO IMO Protect first for both. Then for this local storage, your SD card storage. But don't worry, it will add up, up to if it reach max already, then it will overwrite. And so for the audio recording is for the camera actually and the video password. You can actually enable it for, but this one I don't recommend you to set because if not, you got this one quite troublesome. You have to go in to view the live view, then you have to enter the password so that you can able to view, then you can able to see the live view. And you can also check your Wi Fi connection over here. And under more setting, and able to, you want to image, you want to rotate the image, you can able, enable rotate the image, then the image will be flipped. So this one will be the other direction, upside down. If you want to go back original, which you maybe put on the table level, then you just close it. And, uh, so that's all for my video today. So if you have uh, any question, uh, do not hesitate to contact us at 9853-4404. Uh, my name is Manta from Tricycle. Thank you for watching.